welcome back ladies and gentlemen to Moreno Boxing TV. I'm your host Carlos Moreno and today me and my lovely brand new Pure Exclusive Gloves. We would like to welcome you and today we will be looking at how to use the floor to ceiling ball. This is another video request by one of our followers. Thank you very much for the request. And yeah, today I'm going to be showing you guys how to use the floor to ceiling ball. What is the floor to ceiling ball? Good question. The floor to ceiling ball is just like a ball, like a speed ball, or any other boxing so called ball. You pump it up, it's inflated, you attach one rope to the top, one to the bottom, one rope, the elastic band attaches to the floor, one to the ceiling, and then you can hit it. The thing about the what makes the metal floor to ceiling more cool is the fact that when you hit it, it tries to hit you back. So if I jab it, it tries to jab me back. It always comes back. Okay? You know, they say what goes up must go down and what goes in must come out. So, I'm here in my boxing stance. Okay, nice and relaxed. I'm going to start off first. I'm going to shoot the jab. The ball's going to come back. Now what we're doing, we're looking for head slots. Those of you who don't know about head slots, you need to go back and watch my beginner tutorials. But let's go through it. Head slots is where you place the head. Back, down, left, right, and then your normal head slot. You can slot your head down, slot it back, left, right. You got that? So, this is all head movement now. We're going to start off by moving the head back, okay? So this is a nice little warm up. You shoot, get your distance first. Start off here, shoot, pull back, shoot, pull back, back. As you get more confident, what you can start doing is shooting harder, shoot the jab harder and faster. Now what I do as well, I keep my right guard on my chin, just in case I can't get back far enough, I'm going to use my hand to catch. So sometimes you can't always lean back quick enough, so you go, catch, yeah? you lean back and you catch, okay? just in case you get them really clever fighters, they don't stay there doing that, they step in, boom, you want to catch, have a second line of defense, first line of defense, lay back, second line of defense, catch. After that, when you're used to lay back, you're going to warm up by practicing slipping to your right. Outside slip. You're slipping outside of the opponent's guard. It's called an outside slip. Again, go and watch the beginning tutorials if you want to know more about outside slipping. I'll put a link in the description below. Jab. Slip. There, show me. Next one, slipping outside. Always looking at the top. Okay, once you're confident, you can start bringing one, twos, different punches, and you can start moving ahead either way. So here, you move back. This was also good for your accuracy. See that little step back? You can step back as well. Just step back, get that range. Back to next.
ce soir. You guys get the idea, yeah? So that's how I use the floor to ceiling ball. Just try different things, experiment, and obviously there's ways to develop it. You can hold dumbbells, uh, you can maybe tie your feet together so you don't move too much. Try different things. You can only pivot, do it only on the pivot. Don't step your back, stay in range, do it on the pivot, make sure you move your head. Try different things, let's see how it works for you. And thank you for tuning in to Moreno Boxing TV. Have a good time on the floor to ceiling wall. Peace.